Welcome to this series where we are playing Star Salvage for Imperium Galactic Survival. And we're currently stood on the bridge of my capital vessel overlooking a, a slime wandering around the beach where we put down on this um, what's it? temperate junkyard planet here. And in this part, I was going to head back to the starter planet to pick up some fuel. But I, well, whilst I was kind of thinking about it, I was checking this um, planet here. And I did find a, is it a, there is a planet here that I want to visit and I can't remember where it is now. Um, let's see if I can find it. <laughs> it is in here. This is the planet um, Glorious. You can see it's got multiple anti-aircraft turrets on it. So what we're going to do is we're going to go up into space. We're going to go to here because what I'd like to do is move forward with the mission to destroy Xerox drones and I'm hoping that if it's got anti-aircraft turrets on it uh, we're gonna have uh, um, we're, we're gonna have some drones on it well, that's the idea now for to give you an update if you want to know about the auto miner oops oh, I can't pick it up I, I picked up a little bit as raw zircosium not much because it was a very small deposit but hopefully we might be able to use the auto miners if we find a planet that's worth staying on for a little while. So what we're going to do is get up into space and then visit that planet and see what mischief we can get into. Can't find the tag. So first things first, what we'll do is we'll put on the fuel generator. Sometimes when you're doing this, it it drops the the target when you you lock when you're down on the planet. But that's okay. Here we are. We're going to head for the Glorus sector. Where we go? What have we got here? No asteroids. Got a junkyard. The other thing also is I wonder if these are actually ghost ships. And part of me says that maybe we should be going in and checking them out as well. Anyway, we're going to head straight for the planet. Hopefully we'll be able to put the CV down on the planet. And what I'll do is I'll see you once we arrive there. So here we are. We'll just put the inertia drives back on. We're just about to break the atmosphere. Okay. <laughs> uh, we can't go down on the planet because it's restricted against CV. So we're just going to have to put the ship here. And thrusters off. Um, jump up. See, I'm trying to think what am I going to need. And on the planet, we're going to need to take some food with us. Just in case. See, I've just had a thought. And before we go, uh, food and meds. Food and meds. Um, but. We've got eight of those. Well, some I know stuff with us. I think we've got plenty of other meds. The other thing I have been doing is I was, did an experiment with the health kits for the other mission, but the other thing that's just occurred to me is is it exploration? No, it's not exploration, is it? Or is it engineering? Yeah, it says place a teleporter. I think what we'll do is we'll just very quickly do this. Um, I don't know if I've un actually unlocked the teleporter. Problem is, where is it? Um, <laughs> um, the large devices. Let me just have a quick flip through here and see if I can find the teleporter. Oh, there it is. So we're just going to unlock the teleporter and get into here. I've got. Uh, I'm just curious if to see if I've got a teleporter, whether that will help me with anything. But emergency teleporter HV. But I think that is something. What we got here? What's this? This is the. This is the base teleporter. This is the CV teleporter. So this is the one we got to build. I want it on the CV. So what I'm going to do is just very quickly build that. 
um and then we'll put it down i'm gonna have to think about where i could put it down i could put it on this the light on the subject put it on this corner i suppose because there's plenty of room or i mean i don't really want it there oh, i suppose i could tuck it in this corner it depends how big it is now i'll be completely up front i'm not the greatest fan of teleporters simply because i've I've never really found them that practical. Um, I'm sure that some of you have probably um, had reasons to use them, but not. it's an update as well. Our, our Pentaxid is growing a little bit here. So uh, hopefully... And what I've also done is I've put a couple more back here. So we've got four Pentaxid on the planet, um, on the ship. So... Hopefully that will give us some kind of advantage, I suppose, over time is probably the way of saying it. Not the berries, not me, these grown. These are still growing. Just dump off that. Getting more food. Not that we've got a food shortage. <laughs> um, I mean, we do have another mission do loads of medical stuff but I'm kind of half putting that off mainly because I I can't see the point really <laughs> I've got maybe if I get very awash okay so where's the teleporter it's in building supplies uh, building supplies oh, I'll just do it a quick way I'm gonna just put the we have to turn off the shields but it's not that big so we could just tuck it on this corner here. Teleportation systems online. You're now talking. Congratulations, you've achieved rank seven engineering. We got some salvage charge. We've achieved. We've received a, a distress call from the UES Fukushima. It is the signal originate in a decent called Kurashina Beta. Should head there. Let's go. <laughs> Incoming signal. Analyzing. Uh, it appears that the signal originator from there should be there. Okay, um, rank eight. Has that skipped over? Because we've already done it. Uh, let me just see. No, okay. I think it's now skipped forward. So the, what's happened is that the uh, the missions uh, have come together. I think. No, does in investigate the. Um, video voices but we've done this it's just curious sounds like a plan so what we've got now is a kind of circular mission by the look of it um because we've technically we've done this already but i don't really want to redo that um <laughs> we're going to go back to combat and get back to what we were going to do it's destroyed yet. So it looks like there are multiple paths to the, the main mission. I actually quite like that. Uh, we'll just shove this in. Oops, put them on the right one. Now the question I want now is what armor am I wearing? How badly damaged is it? It's okay at the moment. The other thing I also want to check is fuel levels. How much fuel have I got in the Silver Shadow? Uh, I don't need all this stuff, so this can go to general supplies. We're not going to be dropping these down, so we can take these off. Got a little bit of fuel. We've got a environmental suit and medium armor. Kind of take those with us just in case. I mean, they don't weigh a lot. And, uh, field is on and down we go and we've got about 10,000 rounds of 15 millimeter I'm not feeling it guys <laughs> um is there any lots of resources here so we could mine to pick up some resources actually what are the resources 
I wouldn't mind the gold. Um, the Zycosium and the Estrum would be nice. Because that would give us a little bit more flexibility. Right, so what we're going to do is we're going to go come down here and start exploring the planet and see what we can find. And, uh, well, and then we'll take it from there. Okay, guys, welcome back. I've found the first couple of resources here. So we're going to go in and check that. Um, this is going to be interesting. It's right. We found a very small estrum deposit. I think we will just drop down and mine that. Looks like there might be some pentaxid here. Looks like we've got um, some bug uglies as well. Anyway. Out very quickly. What's that there? Uh, resource drill. Okay. But the radiation is quite high here, so this could be interesting. And just jump there. What we'll do is go up to. I uh, it out there. We've got some steel plates, a little bit of cobalt alloy. I'm going to go very quickly drill down and see if we can get this estrum. There it is. It shouldn't take very long because it's only a very small deposit. That might be it. Oh, there's a little, tiny little bit there. Oh well. <laughs> oh, how much estrum do we get? Oh, 13 estrum. Well, 13 estrum is 13 estrum. Right, we're just going to head over to there and see what, what this one is. We've got a very small Sycosium here as well. Got an Overseer. Huh. Got him. I can't remember what we, you can get from an Overseer. We'll just have a quick look. I think we might get some radioactivity from them. Just have a quick look. Yeah, we've got some Pentaxid. That's what I meant when I said radioactivity. Made some food. Let's put that in there. Down. Looks like this one might be quite deep. So this could be a little bit of a challenge. So we're just going to come here. I've got radiation of 15, so can't afford to stand outside very long. Um, right, we're just going to drill down again. See if we can get the Narcosium. This combat drill is really nice. <laughs> Yeah, we're right on the extreme range of the drone, but we should be okay. That is it. Not seeing anything else around here yet. It's all crushed stone. So we've got... Um, what was that? 74 Zarkosium. That, that's kind of substantially increased the amount of Zarkosium that I've got actually got, or raw Zarkosium. So, right, let's just hang out. I'm not seeing anything else on the radar, guys. So, what we're going to do is just get back to patrol and see what I can find. Okay, welcome back. We've found another resource over here. Um, let's see what we can find here. 
Let's get in here. Right, we've had another very small Sarcosium deposit. I think this will be worth picking up. Looks like there's also some uh, actual cobalt on the ground here. What's this here? But we, but we got a couple of these guys. We're just gonna get in because this is this is Pentaxid. So. So we've actually got a bit of a convention here. I saw one up here. So uh, let's pick these guys up. I think the other one, there was one up here as well. People on our radiation as well. Goodbye. Not really a fair contest, but uh -huh. uh, I think all the refined pentaxid I can take at the moment or get. Right, back to the resource. Where is it? There it is down there. I think the gravity on this planet is quite light. Where's the gravity? Did you know? Yeah, it's, it's less than one, so it is slightly lighter. So there is some cobalt rock. Looks like there's some cobalt rocks here. And we're just going to very quickly... Actually, what is that? That's near Dibium rubble. Oh. This is just cobalt. So we're not actually getting cobalt from the rocks, but we are... It's not what I expected, but I'll just give it a go. We're getting slightly better quality stuff, but not what I'm looking for. And don't have the jetpack on. Oops. <laughs> In here. And we'll just very quickly dig out this. Here we are, here's the Zarkosium. Um, get rid of a lot of that there. It's in green food. Put it back to route. And off we go again. Now, there is something to the south of us. It's not a resource. Well, there's another resource over there. How, how So we've got one gold and three zircosium. There was only the one estrum deposit. So we'll see what this is. It's probably going to be a crash ship. I don't recognize this. Under research, this is a colonist um, base. I don't have much to anything to trade though, which is a bit unfortunate. This is where having the capital vessel would be um, quite useful. Um, I think we'll just have a quick look, see. Um, okay, it's, we're not exactly going to be able to land on this very well, but it would be okay. Um, service. <laughs> it's a little bit wishful thinking, wasn't it? Whoops. I had a very brief moment then. I thought I could re refuel the ship and possibly even get some pentaxid. Nice. See what they've got to trade here. Oh, if anything. Right, there's a trader guy there. Um, electronics, small artifacts, alien organisms, alien plants, plasma T6, it's a little bit expensive. We've got 145,000. 
um, narcotics chemicals. Really hope that maybe the in future releases the the role of chemicals and narcotics and optronics gets expanded. Oh, it's got a lot going, so that's yeah. Um, impressive rock here, but the no, it's it's nothing particularly that useful here. So uh, we'll be on our way. Actually, have you got any showers or anything? Okay, there's somebody in here. Fertilizer, human, crew. Now, crew can actually reduce CPU, but we don't really need that at the moment. I think it's C is it CPU? Okay, this is just a roof access. Okay. My ship gone. Nice to visit, guys, but you haven't got anything I want, so we go again. We got a resource up that direction. So we're, we're going to pick up that one. It'd be really good to get the gold. We've got another very small sarcosium here. Uh, just get in really close again up here into the loop protection jump up press f5 and we uh, go down and get this sarcosium that is it so we've now got 122 so it goes in and let's ping out something else hey guys welcome back I've just come down on a gold very small gold deposit here looks like we've also found a few other bits and pieces in the area including some pentaxid probably as it's pitch black so okay we've got get rid of him yeah let me just get this guy and then we're I'll have to show you what I've been doing well out very quickly and we have that raw and texted as well move forward over the gold deposit And here, back to normal. I've been there. Just to show you, what I've done is I, I flew a dog leg all the way up round here, found nothing. Then I was coming out here to start the next dog leg. That's why we're in the dark. And But the daylight is coming round. And I'm not finding very much at all on this planet. So I'm not exactly sure how long we're going to stay here. Probably not very long, but I now I found, especially now that I found the gold deposit. Um, probably that's about it. I think we've just had gold. The rest of it's just stone. A bit difficult to see when you mine in the dark. Okay, so uh, oops. So we got eight gold out of that. <laughs> um, what I will do is, I. Think, not main jump cargo, food and meds, that meat in there. I will do. I'm just gonna have a quick scoot round. Get the gun just in case we run into some hostiles. I wanna see if I can grab this pentaxid here. Just grab this. Keep an eye on the old radiation, it's 18. Uh, 
be worth it just to pick up this stuff here. Um, we'll just grab this. Some more. One thing that I have, it, um, another thing that feels really strange is the fact that I'm so far into a game and I haven't mined any Prometheum. In fact, we have very little Prometheum. It, that feels very strange because normally Prometheum is something I'm always chasing. And okay, we're getting a little bit cold. <laughs> That's because I've got any medium armor on. I'm not wearing the environmental suit. That's what I should do really is wear it. But um, okay, we'll just get into here. We should warm up a bit. I've got a. When I've got uh, some, what we call it, in the bridge here, we've got some energy drinks, we've got a hot, couple of hot beverages. So I can still warm up that way. I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to fly the northern dog leg now. We've got gold. I'm a little bit far. We're going to have to go slightly. And what I'm going to do now is just fly up. I'm going to do one more dog leg. If I don't find anything in the way of a base or drones, um, what we'll do is we'll move on. Okay, welcome back. I've been exploring up this lake. I see I come up through here. I found a, another colonial outpost here. I think I've just found another one. But I don't think I'm finding anything with hostile intentions around here. This is, uh, what is this? Looks like some kind of uh, colonial base. Yeah, this is a base HQ. Uh, I think just to finish off the exploration of this planet, we're just go in and say hello and see what they've got. Oops. Just land here. I mean, they might have a shower or something that we can get rid of the radiation. The radiation's getting a little bit high. So, uh, this is a farm, but we can't pick anything up. So, you guys got any showers or anything? There's access storage bay. Oh, well, uh, and it's free. We'll take it. Not worried about that. The rest of these are red. And nothing. Yeah. Are there any accommodation blocks in here? It's like some kind of a. What's up here? Oops, got up too high. Use that. Just... <laughs> that storage is locked. It's personal. Uh, there's that one. Um, got the obviously these people do not believe in taking showers <laughs> oh well so now is how do we get out of here got to be a way down here that's where we, I'm pretty sure that's where we come in um that's what's the oh there it is yep. here's the core we could declare war if we wanted to don't think that would make us make us any friends would it Maybe one day I will make a completely maverick series where we we kind of attack everybody on site and fight everybody. Um, emergency rations, leather, luxury goods, narcotics. I think if we can find a source of narcotics, it could be quite good. And I think that is about it, guys. Um, Oh well. 
I'm just going to have to... I think what I'm going to do now, guys, is I'm just going to return to the toaster. And what we'll do is we'll just move on. So I'll see you once I get to the toaster. So here we are. We're just at the toaster. I've just overshot. I think rather than going to a new planet, I think what we're going to do is check out some of the stuff that's up here. Because I haven't really put that much in. We've got the junkyard over there. Um, that might be an opportunity to rebuild the ship if it's not defended by something hostile. Uh, oh no, I don't want services, please. Uh, just turn all the power off because I'm using quite a lot of it. Okay, just down into here. Right, we got and taxid. Each one, so when you get one from each of these, I just wander around, the, pick up the bits and pieces. Of bits and pieces. Shrooms. This is. Up the Texas crystal. Keep that. that. This is that. And that. Oh, we got some fruit over here as well. So, what we got? I can all go. Well, we'll do it the easy way. Do it that way. Pine toaster. Raw food. Got that one in there. Or eat one of those. That can go back to food and meds. So, so we got 122 zarcosium, 11 raw pentaxid, a little bit of estrum. So it wasn't brilliant, but yeah, I can live with it. Um, Medical scrap for that, and a little bit of gold, and I, th I think we actually well we could put that in there probably. Got a, that will compensate us for the jump that we've done. Right, so we're just going to jump in here. Put the thrusters on, put the shields back on, just in case we encounter some trouble. Um. And um, what we're going to do now is just fly in this direction. I'm off. just going to go over here and check out what's going on in this area. So here we are. We're just arriving. There's something in the center. I don't think it's actually hostile. It's got a whole pile of um, <laughs> destroyed vessels and general junk. Space junk. If we can get in, it's a space station in the center. See if we can trade with that. Hmm. Base officer junkyard services. Okay. I think what we will do is, because it's in the center, where. Just pull up here. But we got services. Wow, we're very low on fuel. I think we're restock on fuel. That's worth it. So we're just level off. Thrusters off. Keep the shields on. Gonna need an environmental suit. Give us protection from the cold weather. Oops, can't do that. A player. Right, we got a little bit of raw pentaxid in here for some reason. And oops, no, want that in there. Little shadow poster. 
get that there. Right, we'll just very quickly, actually, curiosity. Oh, we got, we've got to deactivate the shields. Just curious. Let me just turn the shields off. I think we're safe. We can actually teleport directly into. Okay. I'm still going to put the environmental suit on. Be on the safe side. And what we're going to do is teleport into the station. <laughs> guys where are we um right we're looking for some traders atmospheric data classified data yeah well maintenance data what have you got what are you offering show me what you've got what's the latest news remember to visit the lobby back okay my eyes over you okay that's viruses and stuff that's right we got major salvage over here so we might actually get some good traders here um right what are these these are cv fuel tanks wow okay bonuses base shields PV repair bay. So this is the place to come to sell off um, military scrap. I mean, I've got some military scrap, haven't I? Yeah, military scrap. I think we're. If we can drop up, dump off some of this now. And now we've got the trader. Not that we use a lot of it, so um, we're. If we can. If we can dump offload all this uh show me your military scrap so i said you're gonna take 21 oh well 21 is 21. Uh, engineering scrap he's gonna take 30. well 30 is 30. um exploratory scrap what's that seven about 27 I think isn't that or 37 medical scrap he's gonna take 21 um it's hoping to up off hundreds not just little bits and pieces um all this is CV related I don't think I've got anything that's that we can building supplies let me just cancel that Building supplies. Don't really want to sell the thrusters. We've got a couple of tier two fuel tanks. Um we could probably sell. We got a CV scanner, and that might they might want that. Um I don't uh, don't really need the large O2 tanks. Certainly don't want to sell the R uh, and things of ventilators. I mean this is all stuff that we can pick up, so um back here let's offer get two fuel tanks we'll sell two of those um o2 tank large o2 tanks we can sell three of those um large construct i've got i think i've got a constructor somewhere i certainly don't want to sell the thrusters Well, it's this capital vessel detector, but he's not interested. Um, we're not seeing anything else in here that um, I, actually, I feel I had a spare large constructor, didn't I? Let me just that back, break that, and just go to CV components. I was absolutely certain that I got had a large construct okay what, what are you selling right this is svhv stuff right let me just see what we can sell from the sv side of things um well 
thrusters are a good shot, so we'll give these a go. Um, we got a couple of drills that we might be able to sell off. And um, we got a large jet thruster, mobile constructor, um, Gatling guns. Uh, no, I think I won't sell the Gatling guns. Homing rocket, rocket launchers. A bit reluctant to sell those because I may actually want them. Um, the plasma cannon we probably won't need. Um, the small SV extender. Want to be a little bit careful here. Okay, let's see what we can put here. Um, what's this one here? This thruster M. What's this for? This is for an HV. <laughs> Just the M, okay, well, it's all those. Okay, you won't buy four of those, you only buy one. And what's this one? This is for an HV, this is a Ruster M tier two. You only buy one of so one of those. This is a Ruster jet for an SV. This is Oh, we only got one to sell of those. Ruster L. Um, it's by two of those. What we got here? Jet thruster. He's not really showing any interest in that. Um, mobile constructor. We got anything for that? Nope. Um, okay. Right, what have we got over here? Right, we got all of stuff. Um, right, we got some insulation boosts and stuff like that now. And if I go to trade items. What we got here a storage boost on a keep eva boost we got some of these we can sell off some oxygen boosts multi boost we could sell um what else we got here now see if he's in the market for any um night vision goggles as well Oh, we got some robotics as well. Okay, wait, get out of my face. Right. Insulation boost. Uh, oh, two of those. The not so we've got EVA boost, oxygen tank boost. We'll sell those. Multi boost. Sell that. Right. Got advanced salvage tools, night vision goggles. Yep. Sell off. Look at it. These are worth money. See? One, two, three of those. Chain source, mechanical drills, advanced salvage tools. Um, have we got advanced salvage tool. SMGs. Let me just sort this. It might make it a little bit easier. Just got ordinary salvage tools, ordinary repair tools, optronics. Um, we got armor boosts there. We'll sell one of those. We've got two EVA boosts. So we can sell those. We've got a whole range of small guns. So. Right. Um. What we got here eva boost sell that plant salvage tool or sell that when well, we've got electronics we could sell some electronics and other stuff um how much have i got in the way right um, what we'll do is i don't really want to sell the basic components it's kind of just fit with me right we got heavy armor wow by ninety thousand. <laughs> Right, we've got a whole load, we've got unicart projectiles, assault rifles, heavy sniper rifles, 
See what we've got in the way of weapons. Um, got some pulse rifles here that I'm not using. Got a flamethrower, SMGs. We're not going to be sell that. Let's keep the rifle upgrade kit. Sell that. Probably sell that. Um, a couple of assault shotguns as well. So we uh, just sell that. Okay, pulse rifles. And he's selling them. Annoying. Okay. Just to upgrade kit. No. <laughs> that was a bit of a bust, isn't it? Oh well. I think we've already looked at you, haven't we? Right, we've got robotics in here. We've got some robotics somewhere, if I remember correctly. There it is. Uh, we can turn that off. One more night vision goggles we can sell. Hey. You like getting in my face, don't you? Uh, robotics, sell that. Bit of profit. Go back to him. No. Night vision goggles. Where are they? I'm sure you were selling night vision goggles. There we are. They sold that. Um, I'm just thinking. I and mean, I wouldn't mind. Buy 65 laser charges and not expensive. Um, mini gun rounds, shotgun shells, projectile rounds. I think we'll buy the projectile rifle rounds as well. Um, got a laser SMGs. Okay. And I think that is about it, guys. This is. Medical bay. Don't. Right, we got cafeteria in here. Show me your offers. Um, we could sell off some of our surplus stuff, but again, I'm always reluctant to sell. Um, you know, when you've got, I know we've got a lot of a lot of items, but um, put that there. Where the projectile rounds go. So let's just have a look at food and meds. What have we got? <laughs> Actually, raw food. Um, we got two hundred and ninety sweeteners. Nah, I, I just don't like the idea of selling the raw food. Um, what are you selling? Oh, we got. We've got 136,000. Right, this is admin. Not seeing anything else in this area. Have a little bit of a walk around. Nope. I assume this is going to into a generator room. <laughs> and we are back where we started. We've got some storage repository here. Um, is there a repair station here? That could be useful. No, hydroponics and habitation. Now, if this guy's up for some buying some plants, um, no. Um, 
if we can sell some plants. Um, where is it? I think cold store. Don't think he will buy them, but we'll give it a go. Uh, no, he's only selling. Got nutrient solutions, 99. I think I might have some nutrient solutions knocking around. I can remember where they are. I think they're in raw food. Probably sell the nutrient solutions. Of those. We made a little bit more money. Um, we can't pick the crops. We can't steal the crops either. Probably end up getting blasted to pieces by doing that. Right, I think this would be a good point to stop simply because, well, two reasons. The first one is that I, I don't really want to start something new. And the second one is I've got no idea how long this video will last because I spent so much time ru just running around looking at things. So this is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Hope you found it interesting. In the next part, we'll look around the junk ships are in this area and with the view to possibly rebuilding the CV. But until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming.